Okay, hey guys, how's everybody doing? It's a nice sunny cold day out here. Thought we'd do another little do-it-yourself project. A country barbed wire wreath. Awful rusty barbed wire. I'm gonna show y'all how to make this. It looks pretty good. Uh, we're down here at our dock on the pond and everything. We're redoing it and everything. So I'm, I went ahead and put these screws to make a wreath pattern down here on the dock. You would want to use a piece of plywood, do it like that. But I'm gonna be taking all this up anyway, putting new deck boards on. So I went ahead and just done it down here, screwed directly to my dock and everything. But like I said, you really want to use like a three quarter inch piece of plywood to get you a good surface and everything like that. A uh, little bit about everything. We're redoing the dock, making a big seating area out here and everything. Across the pond over there, all that plastic and house wrap and everything like that. I came up with a do-it-yourself waterfall and I worked three days on it digging it out and everything and I had a big gigantic roll of plastic and I thought well if I just keep layering this plastic and this house wrap I won't need to buy a liner a, a pond liner and so we got it all in I put all the rock in and everything like that brought the family out here to take a big look at it we plugged it in and everything and for about five to ten minutes we had one of the most beautiful waterfalls you ever seen we were so, I was so happy with myself and everything like that done it for very cheap the only problem is that plastic started slipping and within five or ten minutes the whole thing come tumbling down so uh, we're going to be redoing that as well but I left that plastic over there as a reminder some things you need to just go ahead and pay the money for and that's a good liner final liner for that but that's a later project so let's get on with this one right here barbed wire wreath i went up in the woods there's an old fence line up there and i cut a piece of wire i'm using leather gloves right now uh just for a safety safety feature also i'm gonna put on some uh safety glasses you know just in case this thing bounces back or anything like that i don't foresee that happening but you know i am you're you're, you're working with rusty wire so we're going to do it this way so here we go we're going to just wrap this up show you right here we'll start just right here on the side and weave it in and out actually we're just going to take it around a few layers It gets starts bending it, it'll it'll stay right in place. And I've got some I've got some little tie wire, I call it tie wire, that'll hold everything together. I'm gonna put, put try to put a few embellishments on here that I got from the Dollar Tree. Uh, and took apart. They were actually wind chimes, and uh, I took them apart. We'll try to wire it on and everything like that. And I'll keep going around like this. The reason you want a piece of plywood and make your own right here, because I'm gonna take these screws out and everything, and so this will be a one of a kind wreath. But you literally can put your several circles around your plywood. And you can make grapevine reefs, wire reefs, whatever you want to do, and you've got a dedicated uh, reef frame. And so, so that's why I would do that and everything. See, she's turning out just like a perfect circle. This is old wire. Some real old wire. So, so, uh, Out to the end of it. I don't know where she's going to turn up at. Up in here. I'll just 
about the perfect spot right there. I'll try to bend one piece underneath it. Like that. We'll try to bend this other one. Up in here. got some of this I call it tie wire um, I've left it outside and it's got a little rusty to kind of kind of match the, the patina of the barbed wire um, you get it a whole roll for nothing I mean it's absolutely cheap as it can be so I'm just gonna take it cut me off a little bit right there whatever I need Try to try to wire this together to where it where it'll stay, just like that. We want it to blend in as much as we can blend in. We'll come around, put it back through here. off now to embellish this you can use anything you want and this is where I'm very weak at I am no decorator whatsoever I just uh, think of stuff and everything like that I'm good at coming up with stuff I'm good at building stuff but uh, I know my limitations and it's not decorating so you can use ribbon you can use anything so I'm gonna go ahead and take uh, the screws out of the bottom here Hopefully it'll stay together. And all I did was we took the Dollar Tree, had some wind chimes, some metal wind chimes. They were a dollar a piece. Uh, there's part of it. I took them apart and I took the, the flowers and the metal pieces off uh, of, of three wind chimes. So we got $3 in this project. So we're gonna hang, hang it somewhere just about like that right there. Um, let me put this in here and get a little tie on it. Like I said, there's no wrong way of doing this, but I just wired these together. Um, Take, a, take the rest of them out. May have to come rewire, rewire the flowers and the ladybug here to get to get it all nice and straight and everything. But you'll get the idea right here. And I am gonna have to do that. So we'll just, we'll rewire that. But you get the idea. Cheap, cheap little decoration. Gonna last for a long time since we get all them wired up and everything. Looks good, $3. Been to own the house a long time. Nice country collectible. Like I said, you can embellish it any way you want to embellish it. Uh, you can make just, I wanted to just to tie a bandana. I couldn't find a bandana on it and make it a cowboy wreath. But any way you want to embellish it, you can. Hey, simple project. You saw me build it right here. If you learned anything, like, subscribe, comment, 
I'd appreciate all the all the support I can get. Gonna be doing a lot more projects. Everybody have a blessed day. Get out there and make something. I guarantee you're gonna like it. Somebody's gonna like this if you gave it away. Thank you.